Hey guys, what's up? In this video, I'm going to show you how you can import uh, videos from your YouTube channel to your EC Agent Pro website automatically without having to do a single thing. Now, this is a feature that I had to learn on my own. I didn't know that this was something that you could do, uh, but I want to share this with you because most EC Agent Pro uh, users, at least from my experience, um, they most of them do YouTube videos. So let me show you here on my screen how you can get that set up. Now, if you don't have EC Agent Pro and you're looking for the best uh, website that's easiest to use, that's easy to uh, navigate, that your clients will actually want to use or new leads that you get, then you should definitely check out EC Agent Pro and check out this uh, video that I have here where I talk about EC Agent Pro and some of the features it has. All right, so when you first go to the EC Agent Pro uh, backend, so you'll go to apps and then it'll bring you to this part and then you'll go to the uh, Blogger Pro um, app here and then you go to settings and then on settings on the left side here you have auto blogger and you have youtube import so you hit the youtube import and then it says uh your lead site will check your youtube channel for new public videos once per day if it finds a new video it will import it in a post so you want to have that on uh it'll ask you for a youtube channel id um so you you know you have to find that on your on your youtube channel and it's um series of numbers and letters found in the URL when visiting your channel, right? And then you go to uh, post data, so you can have two options. You can have it published, or you can have it as a draft. I used to have it as a draft, so that way, as I make videos, it will show up um, here, and then I would have to go in and kind of edit some of the video description. I'll kind of show you what that looks like, but uh, honestly, I ended up changing to publish, so that way videos can start going on my website, and and uh, help with some uh, SEO and content on my website. So uh, that way, when people go to your website, they see that you have new content uh, on the blog post side, and I'll show you what that looks like, but then they'll see that, and that's always a good sign. Sometimes you go to websites and they have things published like that were a year ago, and, and that doesn't look very good. So you hit publish, and then you can hit save, or if you hit run now, it will check the most, uh, the most recent 10 videos and import two of them that have not been imported before so that's how it would that's how you would set this uh automatic import and then let me show you what it will look like on the uh kind of a customer uh view on the website all right so here is the front end you know use uh user interface or the website i guess and then when you click this is the latest post i did so this is how it will be uh imported so the video itself and then this is what I have for video description. And then I had a link here and that's how it'll import. So it'll take whatever you wrote on the video description on YouTube. And so then you can go in here and you can uh, change that or add more um, and do that way. Let me show you what it will look like from the back end. All right. So this is what it would look like uh, on the back end. So the title of the video, the video itself and the description. And obviously you can come in here and change it. And for those of you who don't have EC Agent Pro or maybe you have it, but you haven't, I guess, looked into it enough. One of the things that I love about this website is that it has a SEO tool. So for example, this video is about, you know, Rochester, Minnesota real estate update. So if there's a keyword that I want to focus on, maybe I want to focus on uh, Rochester, Minnesota uh, market. I can put that keyword. I can do an SEO title and then I can, you know, make sure as I'm writing, let's say I want to uh, talk more about what, what the video is about, then you can do that. And then it'll start telling you, how many keywords you use, uh, what's your keyword percentage. Usually if you have 600 words or more, that's it's gonna help you with SEO. So it's gonna, this column right here is gonna help you optimize this post so that it starts showing on, uh, on Google. And uh, let me show you real quick, uh, uh, one of the posts that I did that um, is showing like page one on, on Google, let me show you. All right guys, so here I am with the Google site. So I, I uh, type moving to Rochester, Minnesota. And then this is one of the posts that I did uh, with pros and cons of moving to Rochester, Minnesota. And then here I modified, this is the YouTube video and I modified the content and kind of um, summarized the points. And as you can see here, and so it's a, you know, the, uh, you know, decently written article here. And then I have some houses that people can see. So this one ranks number one and, you know, even above uh, this Rochester mom group, which is very popular and they have a lot of great content. So again, this is a very, very good tool to use. So, you know, you do your YouTube videos, you have them automatically import, and then you can um, adjust some of the, the, the content on that post. 
and then you can get a lot of SEO uh, juice and help you rank uh, on the top of Google. Hope this helps. Thanks for watching.